When I first did my anniversary, I had called it a Holy Ghost party. Amen. And I was home with my sister Latanya, the late Latanya Bronson. Y'all know I always talk about my sister because she taught me. Her, her, her and my mama taught me about Jesus and kept me kept me and my sister Shawnee in church. We was raised in church. Um, I was home working on my first gospel anniversary. Didn't know nobody. There's so many people didn't want to help me. And so I went in my room, shut my door, and I talked to Jesus. And I told him what I want for my birthday. I said, not only I want my favorite strawberry cake, <laughs> and I want my sister Latanya to bake it, but I want Eric McKenzie to be at my birthday celebration. Amen. And I said, God, I don't know this man. I said, God, but I'm, I got my faith in you to make this happen. Remind you, all we had, I already had the special guest intercession, community choir. Y'all remember intercession? They came and told out our service. This was back here in 19, 1997, yeah. Um, the show was going on. I mean, the Holy Ghost came in there like, whoo, like a wind. People was praising God. And then I look at Ron. I said, wow. I said, I guess it ain't God, God's will forever to be here. So I went to the bathroom and came out. This man, this man, this man that I never recognized was in, in the building. And my pastor, I got on the microphone. Thank God, Evan McKinney just walked in. I just want to praise the God. <laughs>
hung up the phone. I said, Eric, you got the anniversary coming up. He said, yeah. I said, um, I hope you push fire. He said, would you? I said, yeah. He said, OK. I said, um, Eric, um, can I open up? Sure. <laughs> Let me tell you, you can sell. I said, what am you give me? He said, well, all my tickets. Yeah. Hey, Amen. Hey, God, good. And then it took me three weeks. It took me five days. Ain't God good? Yeah. Because that's how much love I got in this city. And he and, and he put me on the program with one of the top gospel groups in the world. The gospel church. And when I seen that fire, I said, oh, Jesus. What the hell? I got myself into it. And I called Eric. Eric said, well, I can't help you on that. Uh, I could put you on the program, but when you're on that floor, you're on your own. Amen. <laughs> I said, okay. I said, why did he tell me that? I got on that floor, asked God to take over, and God took over. Amen. 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 And then I went downstairs. This is at Donna McKenzie. I went downstairs to Pop. Evan McKenzie Pop. That's I got that famous chopped bottle, praise God. Good God Almighty. Not, all that, not only I ordered one meal, I ordered three meals for me. Because I know I only could get it once a year. Amen. Good God Almighty. That's when the holiday Jews had the anniversary once a year. Now they have it every other year. Amen. Let's give up for the little legends. Eric McKinsey. Yeah. Now, now let me pray for you now. 
And um, not only she a good friend, a good mentor, but she's my blood cousin, y'all. Hey, Amen. And you know how them South Carolina people is, right? Man, they will pray for you, they will preach to you, and they give you love. Amen. Amen. And they feed you too. Amen. 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 Um, I remember her husband, the late Deacon Green. Um, <laughs> him and her was getting ready for their gospel anniversary, getting things together, and and she called me and said, Elvis, would you like to be on the program with the Barney Quartet? I said, well, me? Yeah, you, why not you? I said, let me think about it. Ain't nothing to think about it. Do you want to be on it or not? Because we want you on it. That's okay. We got, I got off with the phone and said, Deacon, what I can say? <coughs> I said, I need help. I said, I need some good musicians on this program. So, I thank God for Ashley Motley and Jasmine Motley. They had played for me. We went there and told the Satan straight hell. Oh. Amen. 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 Ain't God good? Yeah. And we had some good food. Y'all had um, fried chicken, yeah. macaroni salad, cottage green, yeah. barbecue whip. Yeah, I remember y'all had, yeah, had barbecue whip. Yeah, they had a good side of the time. Oh, there was the day. I mean, we had church and we ate. We ate. Um, <laughs> let's give it up for Bishop the lowest queen. Yeah. 
God will let me know there is someone there. Yes. Okay. Yes. When you think there's nobody hey. there, oh, there's somebody yes. is there. Yes. Amen. Just listen to a mother over here when she was praising God. Yes. She felt like she was, she was doing something in vain, but nobody did care. Yes. But when she was, hallelujah, when yes. she was praising the Lord, hallelujah, thank you, Jesus. God let me know. She is someone. Hallelujah. 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 I got you. Come on, joy. Yeah. I look like a broken vessel. The past six months. My God, my God. I was so upset in the past. But I'm still standing. Hallelujah. I got my joy back. Hallelujah. Nothing to go through. 
for my voucher um, to expire. I'm going to hurt it. <laughs> so when God told me to do that, I said, you got to go to South. Mm. And I said, well, I'm not ready to go down South yet. Mm-hmm. But he didn't talk about South. He was telling me it's in the South direction. Yes, no. yes, yes. So when I sat in the house, in the apartment, and I looked around, I'm facing South. I'm facing south, so I'm just trying to be obedient. My church board said, I'm being humble. And that God used me. So being in the south somewhere in that area, I knew God had something for me to do. But I just thank God. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Kingdom of Power Ministry on the on behalf of Elvis Dorm, Elvis Dorm Outreach Music Production. We thank you, New Generation Kingdom of Power Ministry, Pastor Thomas Curry, Evangelist Curry. We love you, thank you, we appreciate you for opening up your doors for EDON Productions. Amen. Amen. God bless you, and I want everyone to know New Generation Kingdom of Power Ministry is located at one. 70 North Main Street, Patterson, New Jersey, and they Sunday services at 11, 11 a.m. 11 a.m. Amen? Amen. I want the pastor of the church to come up and the co pastor. Amen. So everyone can see and y'all can talk about new generation on YouTube. Appreciate it. How many appreciate your stand to your feet and give God praise? 
blood. You know, three years ago, I think it was three, yes. half years ago. So this man that God calls me and showed me the place and bring down here, I saw half of the place from, from right here to there was getting done over. And I saw this place from, from there to here, jumping with power all the way up to here. I said, Lord, have mercy on me. But how many know all things are possible with God? Come on, somebody. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. How many know all things are possible with God? Somebody say, look at God. I saw that we took a little bit of work to do. All you need is some little bit of work in the middle. This is saying yes. And I say no. And get the work done. This man got the work done. Give God praise and give him glory. I thank God for the church man. This is my son. I love him. Even if I ain't here, he got to keep it coming. That's what you call love. That's what you call trust. Because you can't trust everybody. Oh, no. Let me get out of here. God bless y'all. May God keep y'all. We'll bring you God. Amen. I wanted to. Right now, we got a very, very special guest tonight. And this, this woman, God spoke at Pastor Eden's church. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. And uh, she expounded on the word of God. And she also expounded on about the church. Need to come together and stop trying to separate yourself from each other. Amen. Because God has no respectable church. Amen. I said, God, I'm Pentecost. I'm apostolic. What do you mean go to Mount Isle Baptist Church? God said, go where I tell you to go. And I said, Lord, have mercy. And ever since that day, I said, Lord, you don't have no respectable church, no respectable person. Whatever God said, you got to go and do it. Amen. And so this woman of God said, we need to come together and fellowship with one another and stop looking down at one other church. Amen. Maybe you might be an example to that church if you just go. No, no, no. If you just go, come on and get a Lord a hand clap for the honorable. The honorable, come on, say it to your feet. For the honorable. Clap. Come on, pastor. Get the Lord a praise. She got Christ. I said she got God in. Come on, somebody.
what's happening in the city with us okay. and the Black History Month. We are, I don't want to say to the pastor, to the first lady. And sometimes, you know, we said we got to go on the street. Mm -hmm. I don't mind sitting down because I know back in the day when I was down south, we would, um, you know, them churches would be way back up in the woods. Because right? mm -hmm. remember, they didn't want us to have churches. Right. So it's kind of like we, we had to hide. Mm -hmm. So nobody could come, you know, it's like we had to be way back. We had to, it had to be hidden. Mm -hmm. and, but then at that time, you didn't know that was going on. That's right. I told somebody, I said, you know what, we was poor. I didn't know I was poor. Mm -hmm. I did not know I was poor. And I say to people, you're really not poor because what your mother and father did for you, mm -hmm. that's what they did for you. Mm -hmm. right. You ain't sitting there complaining about I need this, I need that. You didn't right. do that. Mm -hmm. So we must make sure we get, there's so much stuff that's needed out here. And it's about caring about the people. Yeah. That's right. If you don't care about the people, if you don't have the goodness in your heart, because mm -hmm. I'm going to say one more thing. My grandparents and my ancestors always said, you keep your hands closed, mm -hmm. nothing going to come in. Right. 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 You've got to right. give it. You can give it. You got to give it. Yeah. That's yeah. how you're going to get it. That's Every right. time I see right. you, you go, 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 go. go. Let me start to come back for you. So yeah. thank you all for coming out. Thank you, Pastor First Lady, for having me and letting me come up here. Yes. I appreciate you yes. many times. Because there's so much that we need to do. Because I said at the end of the day, when you call me, I don't even know who you are. You call me, you need some help. Amen. Yes. And I have to guide you the best way I can. Oh. And that's why I say, Lord, put it in me to show me what to do. Because they said, remember the Bible say, just be still. Amen. And I'll send you in. And I find people are not doing, they want to do everything so fast. Do everything. You got to be still. Be still. And you'll get be still. So thank you all for allowing me, Elvis. Thank you. Amen. You know, we have Black History, oh. Black History Month and that's there's right. a lot of different events. But it's just amazing. And I just want to say this one story. They said the city of Patterson had a fire in 1902. That's a long time ago. But there were many houses in this city that helped run away slaves. And they said when they had that big fire in 1902, not one of those houses burned down. So what that means, God said, uh, yeah. 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 And I said, I'm going to really look that up. And, you know, and they said it today. I couldn't believe when they said not one of those houses burned down yeah. that helped slaves get from the north to the uh -huh. south to the north. So I ain't not for God for that. So I'm for God. And you'll be surprised our uh, history here in this city. Yes, we, we got great history in this city. We can never right. forget. We got to make sure we tell our young kids the history that we had in this city. To help build the city of Patterson, New Jersey. Yeah. Yeah. Because we built the city. Yeah. And they don't want to accept it. They don't want to tell us, but we built the city. Yeah. And let's make sure, just bring our kids out. Whatever we can do, do whatever we can help with each other. And it's about caring, it's about loving. And I know, coming from the South, being a share prophet's niece, how they try to pitch you against each other. Yeah. And my ancestors are right there. They would not allow that to happen. And they'd be saying, you know, so-and-so said this about you. And you know, so-and-so said this about you. Mm -hmm. You can't believe what people say. Mm -hmm. So with That's that right. being said, God bless you all. Have a good day.